Welcome back to the Oski. I am Gray, and today we are actually going to have a video with commentary. Sound. Yep. How's that sound? That sound good? That sounds good to me. Um, after that fucking debacle. Um, okay. Debacle. Yeah. We are going to head into Angmar. Um, but first, we have to talk to Aragorn here in Rivendell. Actually, we're not going to go straight into Angmar. we got to do some quests to kind of open up that area. First, if I remember right, in North Downs. We're going all the way to North Downs? Mm hmm. Hmm. That's where we're going to end up. End up there, do some shit, and then we'll be able to move on. Um. I see. What? I see. I should be able to see. Um. It actually might be some a lot of traveling, and I'll get into. Fuck, why am I trying to fucking summon my horse in here? <laughs> because you're confused. I don't want to get on a horse and shit. But anyhow, um, we're, we're running through the wall here. Um, well, the door didn't open. It's all right. Yeah. Yeah, I think we have to go to Esteldin and do some shit and do some scouting or do some but missions. not bad. I don't think it's bad. Uh, no, North Downs isn't terrible, no. No. Like I said, I don't like doing quests up there, just like the normal trash quests, because, I mean, it's just so much, so much shit that you got to do between, you know, well, between... Including running back and forth all the fucking time. That I don't really... I didn't really care for. I could do without that. Mm-hmm. In all honesty, but... Well, there is a lot of travel in this game. Yeah. I know, it's supposed it is. to give you a sense of adventure. It is a good place. Whatever you want to call it. Uh, North Downs is a good place, though, f to to farm materials for, for crafting and stuff, though. When you get to that tier, whatever the fuck it happens to be, I don't remember. Right off the top. Ooh. I don't remember right off the top of my head what it is, but it is a good place to go and farm and do all that shit. I mean, there's ton of, like tons of things you can kill for all the leather, 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 leather and, and all the mines and fucking tree branches and shit you can farm. It's, it's, it's a good place in terms yeah. of that because it is so open and there's such flat land that you don't have to worry about going around cliffs. Yeah, like you do here in Troll Shaws where you gotta wiggle your way up shit to fucking get the stuff. Um, mm, gold does not exist. No, no, out here. Yeah. No, no, it does in in North Downs. North Downs isn't too too terrible. North Downs is actually one of the best places to farm for gold. Yeah, that's that's what I was saying. It's not bad. It's and you know when you're when you when you need to progress that shit. So keep that in mind if you're uh, if you're at whatever fucking tier that happens to be. I don't remember right off the top of my head, but. It is I want to stand on the table. Yeah. Will you stay a okay. moment? I must speak with you. Right then. Okay, so basically. Uh, Aragorn is telling us we have to go help Gulladir, who is a ranger who, I believe, I think the legend has it, uh, um, he is believed to be lost, dead, gone, whatever. So we have to go talk to Dervon and Estelden, I believe. So, um, I think that's where he's at. So yeah, we're gonna go unravel all that shit and get started on that. So, it's pretty simple, like, I mean, they... That's one thing that's kind of nice about this game. It, it it does a lot of it gives you a lot of uh, a lot of heavy reading, a lot of heavy verbiage to get through if you're if you're into that sort of thing. And yet at the same It'd time, it'd be nice if they just talked. But that's just me being lazy. Yeah, it it would be <laughs> it would be fucking amazing if it was voiced over. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, obviously this game came out way before they even started doing that in MMOs, which is kind of a new new thing now well, is you don't even see that into like with wow even to like the later on yes expansions yep, and wow yeah. everything else you still read yep yep absolutely because you know it was it's an older game and they only really started doing that like i said in, in the newer stuff but blizzard has had a hell of a penchant for quite honestly just destroying everything no no just destroying their old content oh, i mean they they really completely have. just what Once it's do done, you? it's done, and they don't fucking care anymore. So, um, it's pretty much it. Uh, we're just gonna go straight to the Stelden, because we can. It's all the way down to the bottom. Yeah, I'm just hoping I can go. Nope, you can't. Oh, what is that? No, you can't. Him. It's yellow. Son of a... You have to be level 40. That's funny. Look how close you are. You are literally... Oh, my God. You are, like, two centimeters away from level 40, and you... <laughs> I have to go all the way down to Bree and from Bree. Bree yeah, from Bree, then get to Estelle, then probably. Yeah. I can't even get to South Bree. No, you gotta be level forty. Oh, oh my God! Fine. 
fine. Screw it. Where's my freaking travel button? Yeah, no shit. That's yeah, funny. Curse you, game, and me having not even one millimeter of experience till 40. Yeah, you get two. Yeah, like. Two. Okay, okay. Just for reference, if you can see this, she's got like. Oh, fuck you. Like, that Literally much. That it starts like spot. that, right there. Like, right half of that. Half of that fucker. It's just funny. It's funny. It's funny. It's, it's good Yeah, shit. so I'm going to be a little late to the party. I, I see that, but that's okay. That's okay. Fine, I'll just sit here and drink my pink rock star and watch you run around. Yeah. It's pretty much what we do when we play this anyway. What? You, you watch me run around. Oh, yeah, because usually I'm on follow. Oh, fuck. Using that has no effect because the fucker's standing right here and I drove right by him. What and his little purple, purple get up. So, yeah, alright. So, basically, he tells us we have to head through Ram Duath and, um, to get to Angmar, which is, um, uh, uh, kind of like a mountain pass, um, like, uh, it's, it's kind of, like, infested with, uh, I'm trying to remember, the, the giant fuckers, hillmen, um, Angarim, I think, are in there, and... Did I mention the worms or the lizards? Drakes, I think, are all in there. So it's no, pretty. No, they're not drake. There's no drakes. I, I in think there. there's a pass up, up around, like there's a cliff, like there's a cliff pass or something like that. Because there's kind of a couple different ways to go through there. It's kind of cool. But um. Uh yeah. So yeah, he tells us that the helmet of Rudar are in there. Uh, we have to go. Then uh, you know, get through there and and take on Karndoom and all that good shit. So. Yeah. I better be able to travel from here. <laughs> so we have to go find Coronier. Coronier is, in fact, um, is he, is he at Al Alcair? Um, fuck, can I click on the right thing? Yep, there's Coronier right here. Oh yeah, he's off in that corner, please. Yeah, and yeah, and like I said, here's Ram Dawath, and there's a bunch of different ways to get through there, and some of them are pretty cool. That's one thing I like about this game. Like, you can go like the main path to get to O'Hare and all that good shit, and then if you ever feel like frogging and exploring, I mean, what's really cool is they put in places that aren't just all like level 40. They're like level 40 to 60 with elites and rare elites and all this really cool shit. Basically, certain areas of the game are kind of exotic and 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 not accessible to you until you either have a group to go through there or you get high enough level to brave the elite fucking dragons that are in drakes that are hanging out in there and destroy them and all that good shit so a lot of fun you can't even go to like the other side of brie or are you just driving to the other side of brie you're just driving, driving just driving driving the horse you can go to your next point i can't we gotta walk through there oh and uh, the quest oh. is level 44, so yeah. Mm. You'll get level 40 on the way, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> It'll probably have to fight some oh, things. It's going to take a little longer than normal, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's the reason why we bear it up. Yeah. Speaking of bearing it up, I may, I may just decide to, um, I may decide to switch this character out, um, uh, I, I have it. I explained this actually in the last video, which was partially one of the reasons why it was 40 minutes long. But obviously, you couldn't fucking hear me the whole time, so um, I'm kind of on the edge as to whether or not, not, not necessarily that I want to give up on this on the video warning. But I, I just, I haven't liked it as much as I have I, as I wanted to. Well, is yeah. what I'm saying. I mean, and and it just, I don't know. It's not quite, doesn't quite suit me. And so in the meantime, between the last episode and basically recording this one i've been kind of playing around with the idea of maybe at some point later in the game joining up and uh and and continuing the epic quest line with another character now because of the way they do the questing itself i mean it you have to be obviously a certain level to to get into these things and they all if i remember right i don't believe that you have to do them sequentially no you have to in the chapters, but like, let's just say I was level 40 or 39 and I could do this chapter that we just started going into Angmar and skip all the other ones is what I'm saying. Um, 
So, oh yeah, we could probably, probably should do that now. I was wondering why I couldn't see you on my map. Right? So, with that in mind... Oh my god, look who's level fucking 40. Holy shit. Jerk faces. Um... So yeah, with that in mind, like I said, I may I may do that because did you get the quest? Yeah. You good to go? Alright. Yep. I may do that because I uh, I just haven't liked this character as much as I like I wanted to. Maybe if you were in the tanking or if you're the damage, it'd be different. Yeah, I the, like I said the I just crowd control, at least for you at the beginning of this yeah. tier isn't that great for you. Right now I'm having a blast with the carrier. I yeah, I know love you it. are. Yeah, and that's I think fine. it's great. <laughs> yeah, and that's great. And and that's what I want, is I just wanna, you know, have have a lot of fun with it. So like I said, I've been kind of toying around with the idea and I started playing a um, warden, which is actually what we originally started this LP with, and then I the believe, Bayonians came. <laughs> yeah, and the Bayonians came out like that weekend, so we were like, fuck it. We'll just do the Bayonings. So, um So there's that. Um so yeah. Hello dude. Bye dude. Yeah. Fuck that guy. I don't even know who that was. Somebody um, Rohan. So yeah. Somebody that so, out here farming. Yes. So so yeah, that's that's kind of where I'm at right now. Um like I said, I won't give up on the on this character obviously cuz he's got a badass name. And I'm not going to just like dump him, but I have been kind of like I said just playing with the warden on my own. Um So I may I may I may I may. And if I do do that, I think I'm going to get up to Bo Moria. And I think I'm going to pick it up at Moria. I think. I think that's, so, yeah. so what I'm saying is I think I think I'll finish. I don't know, man. Honestly, we're only like maybe halfway through the Shadows of Angmar storyline. Yeah, well, we still so, have a while to go. So you will have to do a lot of grinding with that warden. Believe me, I would well, sit there. It's just like, yeah. I am... Just freaking enjoy the bear. Yeah, I, I wish know. you were having the same experience yeah, as not, I was. I'm not really enjoying it as much. Yeah, because I'm in the tanking spot. Yeah, which I feel powerful. I feel great, awesome. Yes, I'm slow. No, I'm just I'm just making sure where you're there because there are two paths, obviously, as you can see on the map, to get there. I don't remember which one is easier to go through. Oh wait a minute, actually. I think you may, picked the wrong one. Yeah, we may have gone the wrong one already, because I think... Uh, oh, fuck. I'm trying to... Oh, no, we're right there. We're on the right one? Yeah, I think. Okay, I think. We'll figure it out. Because, like I said, like there's several different ways to get through here, and there's, like, you know, like I said, a bunch of, bunch of shit to run through and kill, mm -hmm. and all that stuff if you go the wrong way, and less stuff to run through and kill if you go the right way. And I believe... But look at these cliffs! What? Look how high these things yeah, are. Yeah, yeah. They do a good job with scale in this game, I think. I think they do a good but job of... I feel of, tiny. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you, you feel with... You know, that's one thing I've always had a problem with. with and I'm an Amazon woman. Yeah. God. <laughs> that's one thing I've always had a problem with with World of Warcraft. I mean, the what? scale is just so oh. big and massive. Everything is just fucking giant. So that, like, earthly formation seems so minuscule and small and pointless sometimes. Oh, oh yeah. It's these two. Oh. He actually has a quest. They are so fugly. Yeah, these guys, these guys are freaky looking, aren't they? The yours can have need of your help. Do we want to do we want to pick these up for later? Yeah, we might need to do these later. Yeah, for we, just yeah, for leveling yeah, purposes. We might, we might need to do some some quests here later. But yeah, see, they're starting to give us look that one's a small. Look at his freaking back piece. Oh yeah, the fucking the tusks from the uh from the Orox, yeah. The Orok thing? Mm -hmm. Don't you want to fucking walk around with that? In your bag? God, I'm afraid you get stuck in doorways. Right? But they don't have doors, so it's alright. No, these guys are like some real tribal looking motherfuckers. Aren't yeah, they? that's what they're. they're yeah, like the. Tribal. Fucking, I can't remember what. They're actually called. But they're fucking cool looking. Jesus, there's all sorts of. I do not remember that many quests being right I out do. here. Did they're you do them? Yeah, I did them with my, um. So yours can have me. Remember Rainkeeper? I can remember. My lore master, one of the two. Me. Bye guys! Thanks for the quest. We'll more likely come back later. Yeah. You? Thanks for the quest we might never ever do. That's why there's always an abandon button. Yeah, right? Oops, Is it in the that wrong. way? No, we'll just just keep going this way. Alright. Follow the road. Follow the yellow brick road. 
That's what really I'm gonna do and try and hope game. that we don't run into too much here. I think we'll be fine. It's platinum. Yeah. And now the road kind of ends, so now we're in uncharted territory. Charted oh, we're in Fasak Laran, so we're in the right place. Yeah, yeah, here we are already. Yeah, this is another tribal. Oh city yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. The. Um, you have Arctic a very. Different oh, the trip Gulag or. Gulag. I didn't there. mind these people and how they look. I actually thought they would look pretty cool, dude. Yes, pick up this. They're basically hillmen, like the evil hillmen, but good. <laughs> yeah, but they're happy. Look at all the quests. I remember doing the quests for these guys. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. I remember doing a lot of quests for these guys too. You yeah, do some I cool haven't stuff. gotten my horse yet. That you said there was a horse we got. Is for what? In, is it in this zone? For what? The free mount. Free mount. But you do on the epic quest line. And you said there was a free mount. Yeah, at at, at the con at the conclusion of this. Oh, that I never did. Ha ha ha. Yeah, at the conclusion of this whole the Shadows of Angmar line. Hi, lady. What can I do? For All right, so here's Coronier. Hi, Coronier. Yeah. Give me your stuff. Yeah. Basically, he just tells you the story of the the Hillman and um, the False King, which is um, Mordorith. Mordorith, I believe. That's who he's referencing there. Um. So yeah, and he kind of tells you the backstory of the whole Gulladir thing and and how they were defeated and lost and all that Front shit and cut off. So now we're going to basically explore Angmar a little bit, and we got to go figure out these watching stones and figure out what makes them tick, so we can find a way to get past them. To get past them. So um, like I said, eh, fuck, I should really just sit here. I really should be letting people read this. I, f I kind of forgot about that. So I'll just leave this here for a second. And then uh, yeah, pause it if you want. And then we'll move down here. And then I'll leave that there for a few seconds. I don't think I did that in the last one. Sorry, but... Oh, when we killed the big, huge, giant, dead dragon? No. No, it wasn't very much that that time. No, I mean, it, it, was, it had a scroll. There was enough text to scroll, so I had to... Oh, oops. Yeah. I, I, didn't, uh, I didn't sit there long enough because I'm, I'm a bit of a dick. So anyway, um... Yeah, look at all these quests they've added. Yeah, I know. I think they've added a lot of quests. Holy crap. I think they've kind of made an emphasis on pushing people through, um... Giving people more quests, giving people more experience so that they can get through this shit quicker and get to end game. I Talk think there's... Cranog. Anyway, um... I think that does it for this episode. It's been... A, not much going on, no. But, um... We're now here in Angmar. Um, and we're gonna have a lot of shit to do. Ooh, we gotta go do... How many of these stones do we have to do? Do we just have to do one? I don't remember. Mm -hmm. We'll find out. That's the glory of not remembering this shit. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, um, like I said, that does it for this episode. Um, you made it this fun, YouTube. You know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, and bye. Bye.